Water contamination is becoming a growing concern in the hydraulic industry. This is due to the fact that the smallest amount of water can severely reduce the life of your fluid, as well as the life of your hydraulic system. Triton Dehydration Station is designed to eliminate 100% of free water and up to 90% of dissolved water from your system. Using a patented mass transfer process, the Triton A efficiently removes water and particulate contamination quickly. What makes a Triton Dehydration Station ideal for most applications is its ability to be highly effective in low and high humidity environments. Another benefit that puts a Triton above the rest is its compact design, which enables high dewatering rates and particulate removal in one system. Let's take a look at the simple design of the control panel. Starting with the emergency stop button, labeled as E-Stop, it is designed to shut down all functions and is intended for emergency use only. Next to that is your green switch with the options of off, auto, and drain. When turned to the right, you will initiate the automatic dehydration. When turned to the left, the drain function will begin. The blue light is your cycling indication. When illuminated, the reaction chamber is draining. When not illuminated, the reaction chamber is filling. The amber light located on the far right side of the control panel is your high level indication. When illuminated, it is suggested that you turn the unit off and inspect the reaction chamber and float switches. Your digital analog display is for your percent saturation. This displays the saturation level currently flowing through the Triton dehydration station. The percent saturation will begin to drop once all hydraulic fluid cycles through the system. The greater the amount of saturation, the longer the process will take. Finally, the change element light. This red light indicates the current element has expired and needs to be replaced. Here we have one of our product specialists conduct a brief demonstration with the Triton A. We add 6 milliliters of water to a 50 gallon drum. We then left the drum overnight to allow the water to disperse throughout the drum to ensure maximum saturation. The next morning the system is turned on. The Triton A now displays a high saturation of 48% as anticipated. Within a few hours, the Triton A has effectively removed water in the drum. The water saturation is now a much more acceptable 37.6%. As long as the element change is performed when indicated, minimal maintenance is required. It is suggested that the hoses are inspected periodically. For more information, please visit our website at www.schroderindustries.com. Thank you.